Hi everybody, I'm Francesco Ferro, the CEO, founder and owner of Parrobotics, a Spanish company of service robotics. We are very well known to do biped humanoid robots, uh, mobile manipulators, and also solution for intralogistics. Uh, I'm uh, also the treasurer and in the board, uh, and I serve the board of director of Eurobotics, that is the biggest association of robotics in Europe. And uh, I'm here uh, in, uh, in the event here uh, with Clara and the robotics about the moonshot in order to give uh, our support uh, and our uh, feedback about the the, pro the proximal. Uh, I'm here in order to give you the new ideas for the moonshot. So the next initiative that we have to propose to European Commission in order to create uh, the ecosystem about AI, a large language model uh, of AI for robotics uh, and uh, uh, in general for Europe uh, and especially for companies. It was very, very interesting these days here in, uh, in the Norway house about uh, the, the AI and the moonshot uh, just because uh, we have to face front uh, of a biggest challenge ever, that is we have to just put together the different association, different mind from educational point of view, like university and also company, in order to create the new moonshot. The idea is not to compete to the other countries like US or China about generative AI, but it's just to create our own way in order to have the sovereignty of this technology and also uh, allow the, the companies here in Europe in order to have their own solution here, based here in Europe, in order to face front all the real needs. The important things for robotics is that we would like to just uh, make this more real. So like roboticists, we really need to solve uh, things in the real world. So the embodiment for us is one of the most important point. And so what we would like to have is something more touchable that could solve the real needs that the companies nowadays have. and. Uh, doing this in a good goals like Moonshot has to have, our idea is just to, to create the proper ecosystem in order to have more and more private actors inside of this Moonshot that just create this kind of competition with all the other countries. So artificial intelligence nowadays in Europe is something that we have only in the university. We have a lot of good people that are just making research on that. But the idea is that we have to just creating the proper goals, doing uh, our own AI based in uh, human centricity. So uh, and uh, and also real in the real world, doing and solve real needs that we have here in Europe.